folks that we're having a discussion about transitions. Transition is going from one blow to another blow. The simplest transition we had a discussion about was the pivot in the arc, which is effectively onside to offside. So, you can imagine you've thrown an offside and we use snap, for example. For the offside snap, we spin the basket up and we then roll it in front of our face. Okay? So that becomes um, a, a pivot, because effectively we're pivoting on the arm. Then it comes to variations. The hands in front of our face. Okay. Second one is the uh, the arc. The arc goes behind the head. So they're the very basic two transitions. How you practice them on the pelt, how I practice, learn to practice them on the pelt. So go to guard, throw a snap, step, pivot, step, pivot, then I would arc. Arc, arc, pivot, pivot, arc, arc. And it's important that you be able to do both of them because then what happens is you can throw a blow because if I'm too close to my opponent, Pivot's not going to work. It gets too tight. So if I throw a blow and they've closed on me, I need to be able to throw the sword behind me. Now, you notice in both cases, I'm not keeping the sword point. So it's going behind, as opposed to. Now the reality is that the margin's somewhere in between it, but that should help you something to practice that difference between it on the pellet. That way, you're not stuck to what, what to do. Practice it every single time by taking a step though, to help getting you into the initial step throw, step throw combination of feeling. So step forward, step backwards, step forward, step backwards. Hope that makes sense.